the hardest thing is we just don't know what happened and what what led to that. I, I never knew them ever to have a fight or a disagreement about anything. New tonight, we are hearing for the very first time from a family of a college grad found stabbed to death with his best friend now facing murder charges. Tracy A. McPierce spoke with the victim's family about the loss Aaron Davis leaves behind. He loved the the gospel, uh, but at the same time, he was he was also a he was a goofball. He was um, he was a friend to everyone. Randy Davis says losing his 21 year old son Aaron has been devastating, and with his best friend Brandon Reisner now accused of murdering Aaron, it makes it even worse. He's been as much as a well, son to us as anyone else. So it's really like losing two kids at this point. Davis says his son left coming on Thursday to go to Rome to stay with Reisner. He was then supposed to drive to Alabama to see his girlfriend, but Davis says that never happened. Got a call that um, from a policeman in Rome asking if I had a, um, a certain car. That car was found in a ditch at Heritage Park Saturday morning. Aaron's body was later discovered off of Tumlin Drive. Soon after, Rome police arrested Reisner. He was arrested for this and accused of this, so it just felt like betrayal. Davis says his other children looked up to Aaron a recent graduate from Brigham Young University who was planning to become a teacher. It seemed happier than I'd ever seen him. Um, and just so much future there, so much potential. The Davis family left with questions they hope police can someday answer. But the most important thing is he, just, he was just a joy to be with and um, he's going to be missed. Aaron's family tells me they plan to bury him in Massachusetts, but they're holding a memorial service for him here and coming this Sunday at 5 at the Church of Latter-day Saints. In Forsyth County, Tracy A. McPeer, 11 Alive News. All right, thanks a lot, Tracy. Stay with 11 Alive for the very latest updates on these developing stories. You can scan the QR code on your screen right now to download the 11 Alive News app for free. You can set up the news and weather alerts for your neighborhood.